YouTube. What's up guys? It's been a while. Uh, gosh dang, it's always the same excuse for me. Been very busy at the Arctic Fox office. I have been around so many people in the Arctic Fox office lately that have been coloring their hair, of course. And I was like, mm, I can't do the blonde anymore. I gotta, I gotta color my hair. So here I am. I literally like Ryan's in LA tonight. Like I always do it when he's like not here cause I'm just like bored or something. But I literally just threw bleach on my hair to get it a bit lighter. Obviously, I didn't put bleach on my roots. Um, so it's feeling like a little crunchy right now, to be honest with you. So thank God that Arctic Fox is like such a conditioning hair color. Um, it pretty much doubles as a hair mask. So I didn't close my filming door all the way. I can hear, I can hear Calvin out there. So I'm gonna use a few different colors here today. Um, I'm gonna do a split tone, which I've literally, I keep saying literally, I've never done a split tone with my hair ever. Um, so what I'm gonna do is half is gonna be one color and half is going to be another color. And I wanna do opposites. So for one side, I'm gonna be mixing Porange and Electric Paradise. These are a UV reactive, so under a black light, your hair will glow with these very cool neons. These are what I used when I was, my hair was like a really nice, like deep peach color. Then for the other side, I'm using Periwinkle. This is a very, very underrated shade um, that we created for Arctic Fox. Um, this is a just a, it's, it is what it says it is. It's Periwinkle. Um, your hair has to be quite light for this shade. I would say that any darker than this, it's not gonna work out for you. So these, these uh, the other ones could though, if you're going for more of a salmon. I added a tiny bit of Arctic Mist to this and basically, People get confused about Arctic Mist and customer service all the time, like in our weekly meetings. Um, I always hear like people think that Arctic Mist is going to lighten your hair. Nothing in the Arctic Fox color range is going to lighten your hair. Only Demi Permanents that are mixed with Developer will lighten your hair. This is direct dye, so meaning what you see is what you get as long as your hair is light enough. So Arctic Mist is a very has also a very conditioning base and the same base as, a, a, as our other shade. So it mixes and plays very well together because it is the same formula. So Arctic Mist is basically something that you, you can even use it as conditioner if you'd like or a hair mask. Um, but this is basically to cut other colors to make them more pastel if you'd like. So I added it to Periwinkle because I didn't want it to be too dark on one side, whereas the Porridge and Electric Paradise are gonna be kind of light. So here's what I ended up with. There's the periwinkle. Oh, it's such a pretty shade. I was looking through pictures and I had periwinkle. I was like, oh, I miss it. Um, so there's periwinkle and here is my electric paradise and porange mixture over here. So I don't know why, but I, I don't know which side I'm gonna do what. I don't really know here. Um, so yeah, let's just get started with this. I just washed my hair after I had bleached it. I didn't put any conditioner in it. Um, you don't wanna put conditioner in your hair before you color it. My hair, my fingers won't even go through my hair. It's like crunchy. So thank God this is gonna help a little bit. Um, you might be wondering, why does Kristen have bruises on her lips? Kristen got her lips done and the lady who did my lips, um, the way that they do my lips, cause I want them to kind of go up a little bit like this. They go from the top, which is extremely painful. Um, and this one bruised quite a bit. So that's what's going on right there. Going to brush through this just to make sure it is nice and detangled for me when I'm going through. And I'm going to, as always, pin my hair up and start from the bottom. But first I'm gonna section this off. Let's get coloring. Oh, which side? Which side is going to be which? Put your gloves on. I just got a new manicure. Don't want to stain my nails. Okay. BT Dubs. Um, we just put out Arctic Fox Hollow Glitter Zip Up Hoodies. This is the first like item other than stickers and a pop socket that you could actually get that has the Arctic Fox logo on it. I'm so excited that we have like literally almost sold out so fast. It's so exciting to me that you guys want to rock an Arctic Fox hoodie. It makes me so proud of my Fox fam. What side are we gonna do? I guess I'm just gonna go. We're just gonna go for Periwinkle first. Uh. 
With Arctic Fox, if you've used this before, you know that we have a pretty thick formula, like a really nice hair mask. So, you wanna work in very small sections so that you're able to make sure that everything is like fully, fully saturated. Because when I've done this and I go too fast and I know I'm not supposed to, if you don't work this through all the hair, oh, that's so freaking pretty, um, it will be patchy. It will be patchy, there's no question about it. It's a very, very thick formula, which makes it really easy to work with and makes it really easy to do color melts and stuff, but it, it doesn't lend itself to going fast. on your face and you can't get it. Now, what I like to do is go through the entire thing and just make sure that it's completely saturated. I like to pull these apart and make sure there's no blonde pieces in there. Um, and if there are, then definitely add some more color to those. I'm going to go ahead and leave this in for probably about 40 minutes. I dripped some color in my lap. My shirt is like a disaster. One thing with Arctic Fox hair color is that since it is so conditioning, it's not damaging your hair while it's sitting in your hair. Like a demi permanent is uh, slightly or bleach. So you can really leave it on as long as you want. It's not going to hurt or make a difference really. Sometimes I like to leave it on longer if it is lighter colors because um, it does get slightly darker. Um, so I'm gonna do 40 minutes. I need to go eat dinner. And we'll be back after it is washed and we will blow dry and see what we got. time in like a week and covered the bruises on my lips and uh, I feel so much more myself right now. It feels so energizing and so refreshing to have color in my hair. I am just so much better looking with color in my hair. Like I feel so much better. Um, and really that's what it's all about is self-expression and feeling good about yourself. And I am loving this two-tone. Like I'm like, living for this. Like I love the two-tone. I actually really like the gold tinsel in my hair with this. Um, I think it's super awesome. Arctic Fox uh, has been working on tinsel for a very long time. Um, but uh, yeah, I will keep you posted on that. Um, I am so pleased with how my hair turned out. I love it. I uh, feel like it's going to be difficult to wash because I don't want to mix these two. I don't want this to turn purple. This to turn purple. So I think I'm gonna just separate it in the shower and like wash one side and then wash the other and then just keep them separate until I'm drying. But um, Arctic Fox doesn't typically bleed too much, but I have been washing my hair in hot water even though I'm not supposed to just because I have an unlimited supply of hair color, thankfully, and so I just touch it up when I need to. But um, thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know what you guys think of Split Tone down below. I know it's winter. I know it's not like winter colors, but I don't really care. Um, I'm loving this. So let me know what you guys think in the comments below. What hair color do you have right now? Are there any hair colors that you would love to see me try? There are a few shades that I've literally never done. And if you've been following me for a long time, then you probably know what those are. But maybe in 2019, I'm not too sure. But um, we'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.